One of the benefits for the Temp Smart 100 is being able to put the device in different parts of your house and naming them different things, master bedroom, kitchen, living room, and going back in an easy process, Bluetooth to each device and have a data reader of temperature, relative humidity, feels like temperature, and wet bulb at your fingertips. Right now, I'm going to log on to Keys Temp. And as you can see, I have temperature, relative humidity, that it allows me to, depending on which one I want to be more prevalent. And then I have my feels like temperature, my dew bulb, and my wet bulb. So now we're going to go to our data logging feature. I have my AAB Smart Tool tripod that I've put my Temp Smart 100 on. And I'm going to come over to my data logging feature. So you can see that I've logged the last 27 hours of temperature and 27 hours of relative humidity. Living in Florida, you can see I have a change in relative humidity in that amount of time, even though my temperature stayed kind of constant. So how do I set up my data logger? Okay, I'm going to tell it to start a new log. And it's going to ask me if it's okay to end this log. I'm going to put yes. And then I'm going to come down here and I'm going to set up my interval. I can set it up once an hour, once every two hours, whatever increment that I feel comfortable with. If I want to read once a day, or if I want to read once a second, I have the ability to do it. It's going to read over 32,000 data points and store that information for me. On this particular one, I'm going to log every five minutes. I want it to take a reading for me. I'm going to click Done. It's going to set my new data log, and I'll be able to go back and look at it and know and feel confident that I'll have a data log reading every five minutes of temperature, relative humidity, wet bulb, feels like temperature. So now that I've captured my data logging, how does that help me as a service technician or as a homeowner? As a homeowner, I can review the things around my house that may be important to keep my temperature and relative humidity in check. Maybe it's a humidor, maybe it's a wine cooler. As a service tech, I can go back to the homeowner and say, let's see if you really have a problem in your house and let's see if there's different temperatures throughout your house. So if I leave my Temp Smart 100 in an office. I can data log those points throughout an office where maybe one person's hot, one person's cold, and I can go back and try to balance the air throughout that building to make it easier for that company to have the most productivity.